Hello dear children, here we are going to study about food and its components, that is the nutrients present in the food. All living things need food. Food helps us to grow. It gives us energy to work, play and study. It helps us to keep fit and healthy. It helps our body to repair itself by making new cells. Different foods contain different nutrients. Nutrients are nourishing substances which are needed by our body. These are carbohydrates, fats, proteins, vitamins and minerals. Apart from these, water and roughage are also very important for us though they are not nutrients but very important part of our diet. The first nutrient is carbohydrates. Carbohydrates are energy giving nutrients. Sugar and starch are different kinds of carbohydrates. People who do physical work need a lot of carbohydrates. Its sources are rice, wheat, maize, potato, etc. Fats are also energy giving nutrients. They give us more energy than carbohydrates. They also help to keep our body warm. But they are stored in the body if not fully utilized, which may cause obesity and other health hazards. Some sources of fats are oil, butter, ghee, nuts, etc. Proteins are bodybuilding food. They are needed for the growth of the body. They also help the body to replace dead cells and repair damages. Children need a lot of protein because they are at the growing stage. Some sources of proteins are eggs, milk, cheese, pulses, beans, etc. Vitamins are nutrients required in very small amounts by the body. They protect us from diseases. They help us to fight against diseases. So they are called protective food. Some sources of vitamins are vegetables, fruits, eggs, milk, etc. Minerals are also protective foods. They are required in very small amounts by the body. They help in the proper functioning of the body. Minerals help in the growth of bones, teeth and blood. Some of the important minerals needed by our body are calcium, potassium, iodine, iron, zinc, magnesium, etc. We get minerals from fresh vegetables, fruits, milk, etc. Roughage consists of the fiber present in our food. Our body cannot digest the roughage, the fiber. So it adds bulk to the food and helps in proper bowel movement. It helps in cleaning the intestine. Therefore, it is very important for the proper functioning of the digestive system. Water forms three-fourth of our body weight and maintains balance of fluids in the body. It also helps in removing waste from the body in the form of sweat and urine. Water maintains body temperature and helps us to work well. We should drink at least 6 to 8 glasses of water every day. A diet in which all the 5 major nutrients are present in the right quantities along with roughage and water is called a balanced diet. 
we need to eat a balanced diet to keep healthy so children it is very important that we eat complete food consisting of dal rice chapati vegetables salads fruits milk etc so children this was the revision of topic food and the components of food i hope you must have understood the topic well by now thank you for watching god bless you all